A blustery wind sweeps through the region today from Delaware to the Jersey Shore. Strong winds cause power outages and difficult driving and walking conditions. In Glenside, Montgomery County, a hair raising kind of day. Pennsylvania is dealing with the largest number of power outages in the region. Pico is reporting more than 14,000 outages, although some are now back online. Delmalva Power, AC Electric, and PSENG are adding about a thousand more homes without power in our region. Our team coverage starts. Right now, it begins with meteorologist Kate Bilo standing by, but we'll break it all down with her in just a bit. But first, let's start with Howard Monroe on the move in the mobile weather watcher in Atlantic City. Howard? Yes, you know the winds, they are still whipping around here this uh, this afternoon. We are now on Atlantic Avenue here in Atlantic City. And, you know, folks, they are out and about a little bit. They are bundled up, and they've been dealing with this. And some everyone else around the shore, they've been dealing with similar situations. Mother Nature gives and takes. And Mother Nature gave a lot of wind all day Thursday. Lawn furniture turned over, old glory flapping in the wind, and sand whipping around. But still, people had to come out to see what it was like for themselves. It's not usually this wild. Uh -huh. um, it's definitely uh, different. And when the sun hits you, I don't care how windy it is or the sand's hitting your face, it's beautiful. The ocean also churned up, waves crashing onto jetties. The National Weather Service says gusts reached nearly 60 miles per hour. There was also a very strong sustained wind all day long. The wind, mixed with Wednesday's heavy rains, left 5,100 homes and businesses without power across the state. Despite having to hold on to their hats, people were unfazed. I love it. I'm at the beach. I'm thrilled. I had to come check out the jetty and see what was going on. Now the number of power outages they have gone down. Now if you, I don't, I'm not sure if you guys can tell. However, some of the street signs they are sort of waving around a bit. Now some of the uh, the power crews they are saying that less than a thousand outages are now across the state. But for now, live in the Mobile Weather Watcher, Howard Monroe, CBS3 Eyewitness News. All right, you guys be safe, Howard. Thanks so much.